Saturated fats is a hot button topic right now because next year the new dietary guidelines come out and there is talk of removing the recommendation to avoid saturated fats. I think this is damaging and I'm going to use a recent patient example to paint why. The main reason I think this is damaging is because it's going to be heard by the wrong crowd. So I saw a patient recently. He is in his mid early 60s, uh, had a cardiac event recently, had a heart attack. Um, he has some other issues, has some high blood sugar, has high, high blood pressure. He isn't really active. He's a little bit stressed out, doesn't exercise at all. And he has heard this from social media and different avenues that saturated fats are not bad and we shouldn't be limiting them and butter is okay. And you should cook with butter and it's okay to eat fatty meats. And he's seeing all the, the bros on Instagram eating their ribeye steaks on their cutting boards. And now he's taking this to mean oh, I shouldn't be limiting this at all. And that is totally untrue. You And he is the picture of most Americans. And most Americans are going to hear this and eat foods that ultimately, if they eat too much of, given the whole context of their life, which is inactive, they don't get enough fiber, they don't eat consistently, they have other health issues. Given that context, if he eats more of that food, it's going to be damaging. And so removing the recommendation to avoid it and then plastering that all over the news of, oh, the government says we don't need to avoid saturated fats anymore, that person giving them permission to eat more of those foods. And ultimately, yes, those foods are totally fine in moderation, especially in moderation within the context of a healthy lifestyle. But for the typical American, eating more of those foods isn't necessarily going to be a net win for health, in my opinion. Uh, so just a thought, uh, if you see these recommendations come out, just something to be keeping in your mind. These are still foods that we should strive to limit because in overconsumption, there is some negatives. So anyway, that's it. Bye.